Alright, I am back with part 46, I think, of PC Building Simulator. Yeah, last time, I think I wasted money on an, a, a pinball machine, worth it, uh, and a little statue and some books and stuff. This time, however, we'll probably just keep doing what we usually do. I mean, it seems to work out for the most part. So, four jobs, all of which appear to be uh, within the workplace. I appreciate that. So let's move relatively quickly, since I have a fair bit of stuff to do. Yeah. So I guess we should start well, anyway, really, but let's get a move on, I guess. So they don't have a process of it, they have a cool... okay. I nine that is achievable. I just go to the I nine, and then we find it. Is it ten nine hundred? Yeah. So it's not the one with the X there. It's a different one. Okay. Add to cart. Same day. Buy now. Run over here, grab that, run back over here, uh, install it, close that, install some thermal paste, install the cooling, and ta-da, now cable, did I unplug everything? Yeah, I did, I unplugged something. That was a whoopsie. Okay, let's power that up and put the side panel back on and install the USB okay they want four guys installed that's fine we can restart now that's how we do the business what business doing business doers I don't know Okay. That's computer numero uno done. Let's see, this was one that I worked on before, so that's concerning. Let's empty that. They want that replaced. How much are they paying me? Uh, is this it? No. Here we go. 3,000, so that's not terrible. Okay, I thought I was getting ripped off, but we're good. So, replace this graphics card. Uh, what are called GPU. Needs replacing. So, if I can upgrade the graphics card, possibly. Let's go to water cooling shop and water cooled GPUs. VRAM minimum, all of it. Okay, so what did I have? I, oh, it's not even here, it's, it's scared of me. Okay. Let's see. I don't know what the Arctic, st uh, Arctic storm part means. Ultra high copper gaming. I mean, let's spend two thousand dollars on a thing, meaning that we only have a thousand left if this goes wrong. Hopefully I can sell it for a fair bit though, either way. It is a, uh, whoopsies. Where, where's the water called? Oh, there. So yeah, so they somehow broke that. Even if this doesn't cooperate, I can sell it for 600, which is quite handy. Okay, so that counts as me replacing that. Let's uh, pipe everything back up. No, that's not right. Hang on. Uh, remove cables. 
and stuff. Okay, let's cable. No piping. Let's put that to that. And uh, no route for flexible pipe. Okay. Um. Jeez. No route for flexible pipe. What? Okay. Let's see. Can I install connectors? Okay, let's go to the, the store real quick and get pipes. Can I get a clear rigid pipe? Let's try this. This is probably my best bet. Yeah. Whoops. Okay, install piping. Change the pipe to rigid. Does that want to work? Okay, drag, click for bends. Damn, this really doesn't want to bend. Oh. Where can it go? Can it go there? That looks fine to me. No, oh, it doesn't, but still. And could I, in theory, make like a very big splotch? I could, but that looks bad. So I don't know what it's what its issue is. It doesn't want to be here. Okay, remove remove corner. So it's just extra steps. Hang on, undo. It's just. Uh, let's see. Can I put one from there to there? Why can't I? I mean, it did work before. I mean, let's uh, close that. Let's just quickly install the uh, PCI lock again. See if that's the issue. Then go pipe in clear flexible. See, if that doesn't work, why is there an option for it? Okay. So the issue here is that it doesn't want to work. And that isn't a, a big issue. It's a very big issue, and it's concerning. Uh, let's go back to piping. What if I start off like that? So that just doesn't want to work. And notice that. Okay, let's remove the lock again. Unplug that. Unplug all of this. Move this. Can I install it at a higher point? No. So that's the only place it can fit in, really. Which isn't good. What's supposed to go there? Something. Hmm. Can I go piping from there to, like, there? No. <laughs> what kind of piping would it want, then? Clear rigid. I don't know. Let's go from there to there. No, from there to there. We've got some big issues. If I power up the rest of the loop, or like plug in the rest of it. Okay, wait, cancel. Let's go back to the clear flexible because it, it's easier to use. That just doesn't want to hook up to the GPU now. Which is an issue. A big issue. Okay, so let's just... 
Can I power it up as is? I can, but there's no cooling to that. Let's install some yellow coolant again, since I think that's what they wanted. Okay, this isn't going to be too good without that plugged in to coolant. But hey, it doesn't need to be practical, it needs to be functional. Uh, let's also get the uh, lighting software just while I'm here. Okay, I'm going to pretend that that works fine, although it's not plugged in. No, it says missing pipe, it won't work. Okay. That's not good. Okay. Let's remove... Empty the reservoir. Hey. <sighs> Let's remove the reservoir, maybe, and then go to the tablet, then go reservoir. Okay. This one's 400, add to car. Fine now, watch it not fit and be mean and sad. Uh oh, I did oopsie. I just spent money and it can't be used. Actually, can I fit the other reservoir? No, I couldn't, could I? because this one's too wide for the radiator. Okay, let's just try this again, but with the same day instead of three to five working days. Then install it. Uh, there we go, it doesn't fit. Why does that one say it doesn't fit? I don't know. Let's take that off. Let's see. We can cable it or pipe it bit by bit. Why why? Why? Why no root? What would the root be? Why could the old one work but this one doesn't? This is gonna be painful if this doesn't turn out to be functional I might have to get the old one back the old graphics card of theirs which is stinky poopy bum since that cost a lot of money so let's go inventory let's just sell that because we've got another one coming sell that since no one seems to want it can sell that uh, yeah, so let's go now to the store where I'll go water cooled GPUs and find the 2080 Ti that they had. I could probably do that by going manufacturer NVIDIA. No. Nope. Nope. I'll just go through them all until I find it. There we go, this was it. Add to cart. I've probably gone well over my budget for this. But who cares at this point? I just need to get it to function. So let's install the water cooled GPU. Put it right back where it was. Uh, I don't need it, I don't think, but I'm putting that there, just better be safe than sorry. Chuck the radiator. What? Do you mean you can't fit it? It was in before. Okay, look for a new CPU block. This one is 70 bucks, so I'm going to same day delivery this. Quickly run over here, pick it up, run back, install it, preferably. Please. Thank you. Then go piping from there to there, and there to there. So that works, but the other graphics card doesn't want to cooperate. That's silly. 
Okay, now I will install coolant. Yellow UV coolant, because that's what they had. Okay, power it up. Oh wait, I have to wait for this. This is sad and painful. Okay. Chuck the lock back in. Uh, install the side panel. Power it up. Then we'll run 3D mark. Oh, actually, I'll do the lighting first. We can just select all lights. Static. Click zero there. Apply. That's that part done. Now we need to hope that 3D Mark doesn't betray me. I can run that. I'll close it and work on something else because that's taking way too long. Ah, okay. Remove viruses, run byte back, and boot to OS. Uninstall cookbooks. So I did not need to open that. What I did need to do is install a USB drive because that helps a lot. Okay, now let's go here, uh, remove programs, cookbooks, don't restart just yet, so what was everything you wanted installed, byte back and the virus scanner, okay, see that's easy stuff, that is the business, we can do that very easily and it isn't painful. So, Hazard, that does look like it's going to get at least 10,000, I hope. I mean, it should, otherwise why would it give me the, uh, the task? But, yeah, we're going to do this stuff. Clean files, that's done. Bite back. Start. Agony is happening today. That little water, cool like water cooling predicament set us back a fair while. Like, a, it's a lot of money down the toilet, essentially. Okay, that one's done. That is good. Put that one there. That is a very cool case. 12,000. Okay, we did it. Well, we're happy. We're done. Putting that one there. Alright, what do you need done since you sent me a case? Okay, you want Unify 4D installed and working. You want four lights. What case is this? Parts. Okay, let's install a... Let's, let's buy. <laughs> let's go to the shop and buy a motherboard. This one's decent. Then we go... That's form factor is SATX. That seems to work with almost anything. AM4 processor is required. So let's go uh, manufacturer AMD series Ryzen 7 or something should be good. Ryzen 7 8 core. This one. Okay. Cooling socket AM4. Should check that that's an AM4 socket, actually. One way to find out now, I guess. The painful way. Okay, so. Get that because it's cheap. Actually, no, let's remove that. Let's go to cooling and quickly get socket AM4 and lighting RGB. This is cheap and has good lighting, or RGB lighting. So, memory. Let's go manufacturer, Corsair, why not? And get them two sticks of eight. Graphics card. Um, I'll find them one. I'll just pick one. I don't think they need to run anything specific. So we should be good. To just snag something. Uh, that's sixty dollars. That's what well, it's six hundred and fifty dollars. I got the words out eventually. We're good. Storage a terabyte. Oh, you know what? Make it make it four. It's relatively cheap. I'm I'm not that stingy. Okay, 
And case fans, let's get three of those. Okay, same day, since I don't want to skip many days and have jobs pile up. Okay, let's start off with the motherboard. And wait. Okay, that's AM4 socket. I didn't mess up too bad. We're good. Alright, this is a very straightforward process. I slap stuff together and hope it works. Since I don't want to be here all day. Okay, put that there. Cooling, that can go there. Slap it in. It'll plug itself in because it's friendly. Uh, let's install memory. Two of those. These are not RGB, as it has just now occurred to me. Hmm. Okay, let's quickly check graphics card. That can fit in there. So I can remove this one and this one and install that. It cables itself because it's handy. Okay, let's remove the back panel. Okay, let's install our storage. Let's install the power supply while this is open. Of course not. Okay, remove that. Install the power supply. Get ready to remove a cable. Install the PSU mount. That can then install that. Uh, let's install this back side panel. They want blue cables. Can I power stuff up now? We got one, two, three, I guess four. I hope all that stuff's RGB though. That doesn't look like it is, so I might need something else. Um, oh, it looks like they already had case fans, so I'm not going to put those in. But the ones I bought, just keep that. Extra profit, all that stuff. Um, okay, let's see. What can I add here? Hang on, uh, the case fans that I did buy... They don't happen to be. Oh, they are RGB. Okay, let's remove. Actually, let's just check out the ones that they already have. Okay, they're boring and bland. Let's just. Let's take them out. Can I not remove you because of the drive bay? Who built this? Or who designed this case? I mean, it looks really cool, but it doesn't seem very practical. Look, I'm just doing that, because then we can power it up. Alright, yeah, we gotta cable this again. You're welcome. Uh, I'm doing it for the lazy strats. There we go. Uh, install case paths, dust filter. Uh, install the front panel, or you can... In, actually let's quickly chuck in the USB so while I'm doing this it can install its operating system okay we'll install the side panel and wait this has taken a lot longer than expected oh wait no we're not done I oh, won't install the OS still since I started but it wants blue cables for reasons beyond me luckily I have blue some white or blue cables already so let's just cable hey look they're blue wow <laughs> I don't know what you want me to say it's a cable I'm cabling kinda just doing what I do okay that can be unplugged that should be fine it's more cables just going places check it out they're blue pretty cool how many blue cables do I need? Hang on, let's just remove this back panel again. Go, still on remove. Unplug absolutely everything that isn't blue. Oh, that was the only thing. Okay. That still doesn't count as enough blue cables, so let's remove more random cables. And then click the cable button. Plug that in, plug this in. Uh, plug that in. Plug that in. That is all the blue cables you can get, I'm afraid. Yeah. Oh, wait, there is one more. 
that it was that one that it wanted. Okay, let's power it up. Chuck the side panel back on. Okay, you want Unify 4D. Okay, so where is Unify 4D? What is another issue that it is having? Okay, so it's the specific color. So we just need the lighting and we're good. I thought I messed up real bad. But we've recovered. We aren't dead inside or out. So we can keep this stuff for going with minimal pain. There's still a fair bit of pain, but it's minimal. Okay. That's that. Select all. What was the color you wanted? 255, 105, 80. Uh, 105, 180. Apply. Happy. They are. That's good. Okay. Let's see how we reap the rewards, see what we got, and also see where I lost money. So, collect. It's 170 bucks, that's fine. A thousand dollars is good. I wasn't expecting to get that much. 900. Did I lose any profit? No. Brilliant. I mean, I have extra parts that I bought and all that, but technically it's not a loss because I can still reuse them. So, that was a painful experience that I just had there, but it was also PC Building Simulator Part 46, I think. If you liked it, like it. If you have suggestions for other games I should play, leave that in the comments. And if you want to see more videos like this, go ahead and subscribe. I'm a skedaddle. See ya.